Hi guys, welcome back. Uh, Rob from RK Knives and Catapults. So today we're going to um, make some bottle openers. I've already made the template for it uh, from a design I saw online. And basically with this we're using up any scrap pieces of steel left over from any knives that we've made in the past. So just trim the stencil out roughly. Um, that's so we can transfer it across to the piece of steel. I just literally spray, uh, use some spray glue uh, to put it onto the steel. So here, all I'm doing here, I'm just going to clean up the piece of steel. It's a piece of O1 tool steel, so it is hardenable. Um, I didn't actually harden this one, but I think I will do on the next one. Uh, just so it gives a bit more strength to the screwdriver part that I do put on there. Um, just giving it a wipe down with some acetone just to remove any oil and dirt. And then a bit of spray glue onto the stencil and we'll stick that on there. So uh, there we go, that's the, uh, the stencil uh, template put onto the steel. I've positioned it so I can actually get two out of that. Um, so I'll leave you with it now guys, enjoy the rest of the video. Okay then guys, so that's uh, the bottle opener all finished. Uh, I've just literally just put a bit of a satin finish onto it. Um, don't really need a high high gloss finish on there. Um, so there we have it. Uh, all the edges are nicely contoured, so it's not sharp or anything. So you've got your little bottle opener and then like screwdriver pry bar on the end of there. Uh, if any of you are interested in any of these, uh, just drop me a message, um, a DM, and uh, yeah, I'll have a chat with you about it. That is the standard size. If you did want it a bit bigger, I'm sure we can uh, we can sort that out, not a problem. 
we can put some um, like gimping or whatever you want to call it on there so a bit of a rough finish a bit more contoured and stuff like that um, so yeah um, probably even do like a, a vinaigrette on it so it goes a bit more of a black and uh, yeah really enjoyed making that um, it actually felt good to make something different for a change I've got the pieces of steel roughly cut out for the Tanto and the Kiridashi and uh, I will get on to profiling those uh, very soon 